right. Motherfuckers wanna get famous. Bust guns again. Dangerous, dangerous. So the day has come. Cinco de Mayo, everyone. Logic released new fucking album. Everybody, yes. <laughs> so, Logic, rapper, incredible rapper. Um, the incredible true story. Uh, he's he's my favorite album, and um, also he has projects like Bobby Tarantino and uh, Under Pressure. So, but. Today we're gonna listen to everybody, and I already listened to uh, everybody's single, and I was excited as fuck after listening to that one because that track was really incredible, and uh, I like I love the theme of the uh, album, I love the lyrics, and I love what he's trying to do over here, uh, bring everybody together, show it that everybody is the equal, everybody's the same, you know, even though the human race is different and uh, cultures are different you know we are still all human and uh, by the way yeah <laughs> let's fix the camera a little bit so yeah uh, it seems like logic is sick and tired of the segregation because he uh, knows uh, about that uh, better than we all do because for the simple fact that um, he is half white and he's half black and so black people are saying oh damn uh, like well, nobody you are not black. You're not. Uh, you're. Look at you. You're white. You just go over there, like you know. Uh, we're not gonna mess with you or something like that. You know. Uh, we're not gonna take you. As, accept you as a rapper. I believe that's through what he uh, came through. And um, white people are also not accepting this dude, uh, unfortunately, uh, in his community. Like I mean, he, they were not. Uh, but now you know logic is globally known he's fantastic we love him and show us the bars <laughs> show us incredible tracks as always now let's just get into it logic everybody fucking excited to listen to this album <laughs> let's go okay track one hallelujah and it's seven thirty seven minutes thirty seconds uh, pretty long intro over here. Let's see what's gonna happen. Hey! Ah, oh, shit. This is already amazing. <laughs> Soulful and beautiful, and like, the melody is just, the beats are incredible. Nice, nice transition. <laughs> Again, those great skits <laughs> between the songs, like in the Incredible Story. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. Wow. But it was your time. What do you mean? Are Are you God? Yes, I'm God. Oh. Oh. Wow. We're something. Uh, one really. We're something on very interesting over here, man. Oh. Ho, ho, ho. Hey, <laughs> the song was about like the song was kind of telling us, you know, Logic was preparing us for the album. Hey, this is an intro track, and I'm about to spit some real shit, real bars over here. And then uh, after that comes this amazing uh, skit at the end, uh, where the guy dies, and then basically he's uh, about to, he's kind of seeing a, I would say like a paradise place. Um, as uh, God, eventually we found out at the end that it's a God talking uh, talking to him. Um, he said that, "Hey, this is kind of waiting room until you go somewhere." This track is amazing. This track is incredible, and it's kind of similar 
the sound is similar to everybody the, the track everybody which we're gonna listen to right now um but but like and that that's cool you know like it means there's gonna be like great transition and i already kind of heard the first second of the second one like in all the second track so uh it's just like blends in so incredibly well and i love it and um now uh track two everybody we already i mean i already heard it um but um i'm gonna show you my first reaction to it uh i filmed it when it came out initially so uh check this out the sounds, the sounds really fucking good but already oh i forgot to mention he has incredible flow So the message continues over here too. The same message. Everybody here. People. Good night. Like, All right, we are going to uh, track three, Confess, featuring Killer Mike. Yes, that's what I was waiting for the most. Killer Mike from Run the Jewels. It's just, it's gonna be a fucking incredible track, and it's five minutes forty three seconds long. Oh yes, long track. Nice. Let's see what's up. Ah, <laughs> this beat switch helps. is just like fucking with my brain, man. Oh. I need you. Oh. Oh. <laughs> yep. Ah. All right, where's Killer Mike? <laughs> huh? Oh! <laughs> now that was an interesting track. Well, of course it sounded dope, um, but uh, for a Killer Mike part, um, he he had like um distortion going on over there or like a reverb i don't know how you call it probably reverb uh, on his vocals uh they implemented so like killer mike um we didn't like hear him like as clear as we would uh hear on uh around the jewels project but still you know like um he did his thing and uh he definitely brought something interesting into the track which was already going well <laughs> so that's cool uh, and I love, I love the um, female vocals. I don't know who, who that was, but uh, she was singing well. She's singing nice as well. So I uh, love the track. Track four, Killing Spree, featuring Enzo Elgard. Let's check it out. Titties, pussy, money, weed. Everywhere I look, a killing spree. All the things they wanted me to okay. be. They Usually, me to be. logic is not bringing the stuff up. He decided to go trap hardcore. <laughs> I love the beat, it's kind of nasty. Great <laughs> beat. Yeah. Oh. It's crazy, it's so like unusual to hear from Logic as as Pusatidis. Anzo Algorit comes in. Hey. He sounds dope. <laughs> I like him. Oh god. <laughs> okay, we're going to track five, take it back. That's the beat from the clip, from the trailer, yes! 
Oh. <laughs> this is dope. Hey. Is he describing about himself? <laughs> hey, damn. This is very interesting what he's talking about. Yeah, he is talking about himself. God damn it. <laughs> True. True shit. Wow. This lyrics. Even though we're all born and created equal, we're not treated equally. There's extreme. That's a masterpiece over there. A masterpiece, nonetheless, because whew, this lyrics, god damn it, oh my god, how he was spitting every single truth on that track. That's <clears throat> what we kind of discussed about at the beginning. Um, you know, like uh, he's talking about his own story. Um, as not being accepted even in the white community and in black community too and like like the both like he's talking about both perspectives like how they treated him and like like i'm trying to <laughs> i had so many thoughts when i was listening to that track and now i'm kind of forgetting everything what i wanted to say but it's just like freaking dope and like the way he executed that shit Oh shit! <laughs> it's like so clever and so, um, and like, and he was able to um, show his message, you know, like show what he is actually about, right? About positivity, about uh, like he, even though he has gone through all that uh, harsh conditions, still, you know, he stayed positive and he's like. He, he is about equality even though we were all born equally uh, we are not treated though equally and that's also another point in this track and it's just oh. logic he's he's one of the best <laughs> in the game like um, I can say it right now because um, there's a lot of rappers but logic is kind of underrated in my opinion not not a lot of people know about logic and that's sad but logic is just god damn he is dope man the look at these beats and look at this lyrics it's just ma <laughs> mamma mia track six america featuring black thought chuck d big lambo no id let's go <laughs> This is dope. <laughs> Reminds me of old traditional hip hop. You know? Track 7 Ink Blot featuring Juicy J. Hey. <laughs> That was a good track. Uh, chill, just uh, simple beat. Uh, everything was good. Track eight, most definitely. Track 9, Waiting Room. Reincarnation, if that's what you want to call it. That's a continuation that's what I call it. of the Either track 1 skit. This is what it ain't. Sure. So I'm like, everyone that ever existed on Earth, ever. Earth? <laughs> that's cute. Wow. Um, 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 <laughs> 
this is so much there is so much to take in from that uh, basically uh, interlude the skip track waiting room and um, uh, <laughs> it's like it's just like so mind-blowing like the, the things they have discussed about you gotta check that out by yourself it's just so much to tell you um, and um, I can't you know like explain everything what's happened especially because uh, I didn't like uh, understand it 100% what was meant over there by logic but the things which was discussed which were discussed mind-blowing and shocking and um, it's very interesting and like you want to like give it a couple more lessons to truly see what's the meaning behind and it's just like this is so dope like this is uh logic is doing a great job in executing his message and executing the whole album itself the whole concept and i will talk about it a little bit more toward at the end of the uh, of this video uh but um now uh we are going to track 10 uh logic featuring Alicia Carr and Khalid and uh, the telephone number which is shown over there it's for um, uh, suicidal thoughts um, okay there we go <laughs> National Suicide Prevention Lifeline yeah that's what it is I have already heard that track um, and it's about it's, it's a very sad track and uh, it's about how um, one person one of character it's not coming from logic it's ca coming uh, from the character um, he's saying that I don't want to be alive I just want to die today and that's a sad reality for um, pretty um, large amount of people these days uh, as well and it was always have been like that people committing suicide every day and so um, um, it's just it's just sad uh, reality and and I see what logic was trying to do here um, after track 9 at the end of the track 9 he said uh, the God said um, you just uh, gotta understand how life is precious you know how life is important uh, to each of one of us and mostly precious yeah let's let's just go with it uh, precious and people are not realizing it and people are mm, abusing it kind of by committing suicide and 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 that's not good you know so um we are gonna probably skip track 10 because um you know i already really heard it um i don't have a video to put it in right now alicia cara's vocals were great i barely heard khalid on that track but um alicia cara oh my god she has an angel angelic angelic voice and she's getting better and better she's gonna be and maybe it already is a top a top top class you know, in the game in the in the music in the pop industry uh, we're going to uh, track 11 anxiety not anxiety but anxiety with a Z uh, featuring Lucy Rose So pleasant to the ears. I'm gonna get up in your mind right now. Hey, that's unexpected. Logically, literally kind of teared apart. That first man just came in with his approach. I have anxiety, just like you. <laughs> the person I wrote this for. And together, we will overcome this feeling ourselves as we are and we will be happy with the person we see in the mirror nice we will hey that's the voice from the trailer track 11's instrumentals and pretty much almost the whole album it's, uh, songs you know has great beats great instrumentals and it's very beautiful beautifully 
executed. I, I have no complaints over that point. The lyrics are outstanding, and uh, the only thing is probably my complaint is, <clears throat> I guess he could have make the tracks a little bit shorter. You know, a little bit, just a little bit shorter. Because um, sometimes I'm wondering, like, okay, we like we got the concept over here. Uh, I'm understanding what's going on. Can we, like, can we go to the next one? Maybe, or maybe I'm just like in the first listen. I'm kind of just want to like listen to other songs. Maybe that's the point. I don't know. But sometimes I feel like I'm sitting here. I'm like listening. I'm okay. Yeah, like I'm enjoying, enjoying. And then after two minutes, it's like okay <laughs> we, we got it you know <laughs> I don't know it's just maybe me you know uh, but the whole album is executed perfectly like wow just wow track 12 black spider-man I already heard it um, and um, I would like to share uh, my first reaction um, with you in this clip over here let's watch <laughs> Listen, I ain't ashamed to be white, I ain't ashamed to be black, I ain't ashamed of my beautiful Mexican wife, as a matter of fact. I'm not scared of the people who tell me I should be doing Saying that uh, I'm not ashamed of my Mexican uh, wife at all, so uh, that's pretty cool. You know, and it's true, like, why being racist? You know, like, we are, uh, especially in America, I don't understand it. Like, there are so many nationalities involved, and, like, mixed and the people the country itself is like you know immigrants once came and uh, pretty much took away the country from native americans so i don't know <laughs> let's keep it going my own but i all but i have one black is beautiful black is beautiful black and proud black and proud fuck everybody hanging on me right now black and proud black and proud yep uh now <laughs> last track track 13 africarian Featuring Neil deGrasse Tyson. I feel like I heard this beat. Maybe he's sampling someone. I I think I heard I have heard it before. Oh wait 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 wait. Oh now I remember where I heard it. Um, I don't know if you know who is John Bellion. But John Bellin is a uh, he's uh, acquainted with Logic, and sometimes they have songs together, especially on John Bellin's uh, um, previous projects. And uh, John Bellin used a similar beat; it sounded similar. Dun, dun, let me let me check out the song. Yeah, this one. Dun. It sounds similar. <laughs> it sounds similar. Uh, two rocking chairs, John Bellin. Uh, check John Bellin out, by the way. He's he's like really great artist. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Definitely, logic, logic. Uh, inspired by that track. Look how he's going. Sometimes Logic's flow is great. <laughs> he just never stops. Look at him. Oh, yes. Jazz. Jazz feelings. Hey. Damn, like some messages over here that Logic provides is just so damn great. Like, look at this, look at this kid at the end of the song. Uh, again, uh, God having a conversation with uh, Adam, the character of um, basically of this uh, album. Adam asks, So what now? What advice can you give me? And then God is like, What advice can I give humanity? And then uh, live your life. Don't waste your days on the negative energy of others. Remember that you are not your salary, you are not your house, you are not your car. And no matter how big your bank account is, your grave is six feet under just like everyone else. So enjoy the days you have. Worry not about the days that came before you, nor the ones that will follow you in death. 
remember that right here in this moment is all you are guaranteed and I, I feel like it's just so damn crazy how this album is going and like it's so it's so smart but let me finish listening to this track I have I have heard this one, before two, three. One, two, three, <laughs> what is three, happening <laughs> whose album they're listening to that's my nigga J. Cole J. Cole <laughs> oh by the way sorry for using the word nigga if it um, bothers someone <laughs> but goddamn J. Cole is on Logic's project <laughs> oh I remember now that's why J. Cole was on the cover of everybody at the top sitting that's why well that was very entertaining <laughs> J. Cole at the end um, and like the like one of the greatest lyricists came in hopped in to uh, Logic's album and also to the incredible bars to the incredible Logic to the incredible messages J. Cole uh, added a flavor into it at the end although it was very so like so much like a low key performance from J. Cole anyway it was you know it was interesting damn this album um everybody <laughs> everybody were uh, presented in this album of course um, like the major part is still about white Americans and black Americans basically logic tried to connect to relate to everybody to connect with everybody and like he discussed about even like moms sisters and brothers whites Hispanics blacks and everyone else who was uh, presented in some sort of way in this album and that's just incredible I, f I think uh, logic uh, just uh, executed uh, what he's trying to do here perfectly pulled it off well I, I give him a credit from, for being very artistic uh, especially at the beginning when the trailer came out the logic everybody everybody was so so excited oh damn like logic's new project and then uh, there was like a, a woman saying that you know like uh, before there were so many races uh, in the earth it was back then it was crazy and then like uh, the video was kind of from the future and then uh, but now like after the album everything became different you know like uh, and so um, everybody are united kind of a theme represented on here and everybody are people you know and we gotta respect each other we gotta no matter what the basis we're all just like breathe we all love we all um, well fuck we all <laughs> eat you know we all uh, reproduce so you know um, basics are the same <laughs> for everyone so yeah that's that's a great project from logic I'm very impressed I'm very um, I'm very happy that um, he didn't disappoint and this album was truly uh, inspiring and interesting and uh, intriguing also and yeah that's that, that's my review basically that will be it for today uh, thank you for watching thank you for attention hit the like button if you like Surpri subscribe to this channel and uh, I will finish my reaction my review to this album with uh, saying goodbye on a lot of languages uh, so пока auf Wiedersehen uh, arrivederci ciao hasta luego e